So I have a couple projects coming up for a few videos in the near future that require a buffing wheel. I don't have a buffing wheel, so I thought I'd see if I could make my own with just some scrap crap that I've got around here. Is that scrap crap? Wow. Voila! We're making a buffing wheel today. Oh, hell on that! I can't believe it, dude. I've been looking for you for literally like years, man. All right, it's gonna be pretty simple. I've got an electric motor. It's a DC motor, but this thing, it, it, it spins. It spins pretty good. I think I think this should work. And I've got a lot of fabric. Uh, we'll use some, some nice soft linen. Hopefully that'll work for a, a buffing. Wheel. I don't know. I've never made a buffing wheel before, so hopefully the uh, hopefully the linen's fine. And I've got some various other parts and washers and things that I think will help make it all happen. So let's see if we can make a buffing wheel. So thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed that. Maybe it inspired you to make your own buffing wheel at home. Pro probably not, but uh, 
I'd call this a win. I think it worked out pretty well, even though it uh, looks a little janky. I mean, don't judge me. But it worked pretty well. In fact, I was even able to polish my wedding ring a little bit, so uh, maybe the old wifey will be a little happier about that. And I really don't need it to polish anything real fancy. I mean, it's not like I'm going to be doing any precious metal things. We're just going to be working with some zinc and, and maybe some brass and copper, th th those kinds of things. And I think this should be uh, uh, probably good enough. Uh, ish good enough ish is that is that a thing it is now so i guess we'll find out if it's good enough ish in the next couple videos make sure you uh, click that subscribe button and, and ring the little bell so you'll know every time i upload a video and aside from that i'll catch you guys next time